Now she's associated with criminals. That's lovely. That's delightful. If you're immoral enough to get married, did it have to be to a horse thief and a highwayman? That'll cost you dear one of these days. I ought to have seen it coming. Even as a child, she had a swollen leg like the Queen of England. So she's really gotten married. Yeah. Yesterday, I thought we all knew. Come to think of it, it really does show that the fella's audacious. If I give away my daughter, the soul proper of me old age. If the three of us can make it through the winter on one log of wood, then maybe, just maybe, we will live to see the new year. What well, have they got into you? This is our reward, Jonathan, for all we've done. Oh, I feel dizzy. Oh, I feel faint. Because oh. calling the dog quick. Oh. Ah, associated oh. with criminals. Oh, that's lovely. That's delightful. <laughs> this is the only cup of your poor mother has left. Go ahead, give her two glasses. My mother can take twice as much when she's not quite feeling herself. Oh, there she goes again, pretending to be so loving and super messy. I'm making a complaint. This thing's a butt drop. Isn't it real? Can I waste my money on it? What do you expect? Hey? It's as good a patch as any, it's just that you don't keep it clean. So why do you just make more money than me? Oh, that ain't fair. If you crap like this, I'll come a real lawyer. <coughs> what do you fellas want anyway? Hey, is it my fault if these people have hearts of flint? I can't make you buy patches. Hmm? In five minutes, I can make any man such a pitiful wreck, it will make a dog weep to see it. Is it my fault if people don't weep? Hey, here's another patch for ya, if one's not enough. But look after your equipment. This one to do. Leather's no good. Celia, rubber's more repulsive. That swelling's going down, and it's your last. I'm gonna have to do it again. Oh, course. Natural scabies is never as good as the artificial kind. Oh my! <coughs> Look at you! You're a sight! You've been eating again! I'm gonna have to make an example of you! Oh, Mr. Peter, I really haven't eaten anything, Matt. I'm just a normally fat, you see. Nor can I! You're fired! Man, there is an obvious difference between tugging at people's arteries and getting on people's nerves. Yes, artists, that's what I need. Only an artist can tug at anybody's arteries nowadays. If you people perform properly, then your audience would be forced to applaud. You just haven't any ideas. Obviously, I can't extend your engagement. <sighs> Look, is he potentially handsome? No, but he makes a living. He can support me. Not only is he a first-class burglar, but he's also a far-sighted, unexperienced, stick-up man as well. I've been into it. I can tell you his exact amount of savings to date. With a few successful ventures, we'll be able to retire to the country like that Mr. Shakespeare father admires so much. Oh, so you've gone married. What does a young girl do when she's gone married? Well, use your head. She gets a divorce, see? Is that so hard to figure out? I don't know what you're talking about. Divorce! How can I think of divorce? I love him. Yeah. Polly, those bloody fairy stories you've been reading have turned your head. Why, everybody is doing it. Then I'm an exception. I'm going to tan you're behind you, exception. Oh, yes, all mothers do that, but it doesn't help because love goes deep and they tan behind. Don't strain my patience. I won't let my love be taken away. One more word out of you, and you are going to get a clip on the ear. But love is the greatest thing in the world. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Anyway, he's got several women that are laughing when he's aimed. Like it's not half a dozen women will tell.
there now. Each of them like us not with a rat. Yeah, right. Hate? Hmm? That's an idea. Run along, Polly! Get out. <laughs> That'll earn us 40 quid. Report him to a ship. Naturally. That way we get the bank free of charge. Two words, one stone. Only problem is, we got to find out where he's old up. I can tell you that, my dear. He's old up with his tongue. Oh, but they'll never turn him in. Just let me attend to that. Money rules the world. I'll go to Turnbridge right away and speak to the girls. And after that, if he speaks to a single one of them, he's done for. Oh, dear Mama, you can spare yourself the trip. My husband would sooner turn himself into the old baby than see any of those women again. And besides, even if he did go to the old Bailey, the sheriff would serve him a cocktail and then smoke their cigars and have a little chat about a certain little shop in his street where a little more goes on than meets the eye. Because, Papa dear, the sheriff was very cheerful at my wedding. Uh, oh, 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 and what's this sheriff's name? Yeah. Oh, Brown, but you probably know him as Tiger Brown because anyone that's got reason to fear him calls him Tiger Brown. But my husband, he calls him Jackie, because to him he's just dear old Jackie, their boyhood friends. Oh, oh, oh. So they're friends, are they, eh? The sheriff and public enemy number one. They must be the only friends of this city. Every time they smoke their cigars, you eat with each other, they look to each other's eyes and say, if you love the same again, I'll love the same again. And every time the other one left the room, the other's eyes grew moist and he said, wherever you go, I shall be with you. There's nothing on record against Mac at Scotland Yard.